Do you want to know how to set up a weight distribution hitch properly? Well, stick around because we're going to show you the do's and don'ts of installing a properly mounted weight distribution hitch. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for joining. If you're new here, thanks for watching us. Thanks for checking us out. My name is Daniel. Let's get into the video. One of the things, the key thing that you need to learn when doing a weight distribution hitch properly is you need to make sure that you're taking the correct measurements. You're setting up on a level ground because let me tell you from experience, it'll result in big problems going down the road. Once you set up the weight distribution hitch, it is gonna help your truck and trailer stay completely level. If you're going off-roading with your truck and trailer, you wanna make sure that you take those weight distribution bars off because it's gonna give you headache and you could potentially damage your rig like I did. And I wanna tell you and show you what you should and shouldn't do when using a weight distribution hitch when you need them and when you don't need them. So as you can see, the road over here, it's kind of off-road type and you wanna make sure that you take that, your weight bars off because you're not going very fast. You don't need the weight distribution on a gravel road. Uh, when you're finding your campsite, when you're coming in, because there's gonna be a lot of flexing and you don't need the weight distribution to flex uh, especially if you're going to go up hills or over some washboard areas or through washes that is going to cause you headaches it's not going to be good for your trailer the tubing on the frame on the front of your trailer is hollow so that area those those chambers are only meant to go up to a certain pound and then it's just gonna buckle even if you have your weight distribution set up properly it's just not gonna work out in your favor when you're on a, a 4x4 road or not even 4x4 road but just a dirt road you're not going very fast you're going 20 25 tops if that you don't need to go that fast. You don't need the bars. The bars are meant for highway roads or on regular city po city paved roads to help you get the best fuel economy and gas mileage possible. And it helps equalize all the, the weight and that way you don't fishtail, your trailer won't fishtail or swing out of control when you're going down the highway. Thanks for watching. I hope that you got some value out of this video. If you did, make sure that you smash that like button. Comment down below what you thought was the best, what you liked about the video. Also, consider subscribing if you haven't already and hit that bell notification. That way it'll tell you each and every time we release a video. And then always remember guys, make sure you cherish that journey Cheers those moments that you're in, and until next time, we'll see you later.